Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here? And what we have here, we take the log on both sides. That is, we have log 9 raised to power x equals to log 60 from here. And here, we apply the power of logarithm. Well, we have log m raised to power p. This same thing as p log m. That is, here we have x log 9 equals to log 60 from here. So this here, we divide both side by log 9. Divide this side by log 9. Also divide this side by log 9. Which implies log 9 cancel with each other. We have x equals to log 60 over log 9 as is from here 60 can be written as 3 times 20 and what we have becomes x equals to log 3 times 20 over log 9 and this follows the log logarithm when we have log a times b the same thing as log a plus log b. At this here we have x equals to log 3 plus log 20 over log 9. And here we separate this into two fractions. We have x equals to log 3 over log 9 plus log 20 over log 9. Then from here, also 20 can be expressed as 4 times 5. What we have becomes x equals to log 3 over log 9 plus log 4 times 5 over log 9 then this also follows the law of logarithm and we have x equals to log 3 over log 9 plus log 4 plus log 5 over log 9 then here we separate this into two fractions. We have x equals to log 3 over log 9 plus log 4 over log 9 plus log 5 over log 9. Then here we can write 9. As 3 times 3, that's 3 square, and also 4 as 2 times 2, that's 2 square. Then what we have becomes x equals to log 3 over log 3 squared plus log 2 squared over log 3 squared plus log 5 over log 3 squared. Then here we apply the power of logarithm. 2 comes here, 2 comes here, also here, then from here. We have x equals to log 3 over 2 log 3 plus 2 log 2 over 2 log 3 plus log 5 over 2 log 3. Then from here we have log 3 cancel each other. We have x equals to 1 over 2 plus here. Log 2 can 2 cancel each other. We have log 2 over log 3. Then plus here we can write this as 1 over 2 times log 5 over log 3. Then from here. We apply change of base when we have log a 
over log b is same thing as log a to base b then what we have here becomes x equals to 1 over 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus 1 over 2 log 5 base 3 then except here we bring this together as one fraction we have x equals to the SMA as 2 this becomes 1 then plus here we have 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 now this here we have x equals to 1 plus log 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2 then let's check here if this satisfies this given problem that is we substitute the value of x here which is x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2 that is what we have here becomes 9 raised to power 1 plus 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2 is it equals to 60 on this side then here we can write 9 as 3 square which is raised to power 1 plus 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2 this is equals to 60 on this side then here yeah, this power multiplies 2 here cancelled each other we have 3 raised to power 1 plus 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 this is equals to 60 on this side then here, yeah. now we have a raised to power m plus n, which is the same thing as a raised to power m times a raised to power n. All we have here becomes 3 raised to power 1 times 3 raised to power 2 log 2 base 3 times 3 raised to power log 5 base 3. This is equal to 60 on this side. And 3 raised to power 1, that's 3. Times here we reverse this two up. We have three raised to the power log two square and two square that's four. Then we three times three raised to the power log five is three. Is it equals to sixty on this side? Then this follows. So we have a raised to the power log b to base a. This is equals to b. That is here we have three times four then times five. This is equals to 60 on this side. 3 times 4, 12. 12 times 5, that's 60, which is equals to 60 here. Left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude here that x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2. Satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget this thing. Subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell. Share this video with thumbs up and put your comments. See you next class and bye for now.